so the Samson mic tends to pick up a lot of the peripheral sounds. If that gets annoying, let me know. Uh, the other thing I said I was going to try was my webcam, so let's see about that. Oh, there I am. Hello. Um, I'm just going to leave me down there for now, uh, and when we get into the game, I'll uh, figure out what to do with it. I need to move it to the top, though, or it's going to disappear as soon as something happens. We've got chat over here. So this is my initiative to try and be a better streamer and more responsive to uh, chat and other things so that uh, so that I don't come off as an asshole because uh, people think I'm an asshole because I'm not paying attention. So I'm trying to not be an asshole. Um, <clears throat> right now we're in our promotion series to Diamond. I expect to lose. I've never won the first set of a promotion series. And I did not play a warm-up game. Uh, so I'm a little worried. I'm gonna play my Gragas jungle because that's the one I'm most used to at this moment. And uh, it's super strong. It's just super, super strong. There's no reason to play anything else. I was playing with this fat jungle build, but I'm thinking I like my old one better. So in this one, it's got a uh, percentage health on it and it actually gives you more health at the start. The thing it's lacking is armor. Ah! And with a Kha'Zix, I'm not gonna do that. So I think we need to do my Fat Jungle build, which has uh, 8.5 armor in it. Um, uh, I'll make a final determination after I see what else they get. So the Malphite, Masteries is what I always use. This is to maximize the damage I deal when I'm ganking. Um, I, I'm not expecting to get kills, so I always go with the, this one. If I land my barrel Q, that gives them the slow that increases the damage of everything else, and I can follow up with uh, the W and the E and the everything else. <clears throat> um, but this is the most important one because it's going to give the kill over to whoever I'm ganking for. Or that's the idea anyways. <clears throat> um, and over here, Strength of the Ages, that's just too many hit points to ignore, and by the time you come out of the jungle you're already going to have uh, you know, 30, 30 extra health, which is kind of huge for early, early level ganks. Um, let's see, 80, uh, that's mixed AD, AP, AP-ish. So they've got a good mix. There's no reason to. Uh, sometimes I'll use this build if there's like heavy armor and or if there's a they're all AD or something like that. And then uh, I haven't lost a game where that's been useful where they had like four AD champs. Uh, but in this case, it's a good mix. All right. Whoa. Unfortunately, I've got everything on this screen here, so I'm gonna switch. How do the other streamers do it? Do they they don't switch automatically between the two, do they? Oh, that's weird. What's up with that? It's all squished. All right. Let me move things around here. There's got to be a way to edit the scene to be. Why am I way out here? Why is this so far to the left? I don't understand. Uh, I'm such a noob. I'm the noobest streamer alive. Uh, all right. Let's try to center this or something. Go ahead and center that. Oh, and you get the old stuff over there. Why is the screen wider than the? Why is it stretching it? Oh man. Interesting, interesting. <clears throat> I 
is this because the game hasn't loaded yet? <laughs> what have I done? What have I done? I don't know where to put myself either. <sighs> and I don't know what to do with this mess either. So, let's see here. I should probably change this. Road to Damned. That's what everyone's doing, right? That's the popular thing to say. Uh, I need to pay more attention to what's going to happen in this game. So, Kha'Zix is going to probably gank early. He's, he needs those early kills. I imagine he would go to the bottom lane for that. So, he'll start blue and then go bot. No, he could go either way. Uh, in an ideal world, we'll have an early ward from the Janna. That'll tell us where he's going to start. And that'll give me an indication of where to go to make sure that doesn't happen. All right. So this is ugly. This is all ugly. Let's turn off the monitor capture. OK, the chat's not working out. And this, this positioning is garbage. There we go. And let's edit the scene. Nope, not that one. Let's move me over here next to the minimap. There we go. All right, that'll do. And now I'm behind. So normally what you want to do is move out into position to make sure that uh, they don't invade. In an ideal world, you want to have your teammates covering every entrance. And then I'm going here to protect my jungle. Uh, I didn't mean for the Alawi to move. That's actually incredibly dangerous. Oh, she warded it. See, now that's that's a good teammate. So I feel strongly t that uh, going top to get kills for Alawi would be a wise decision now. Um, because any teammate that will proactively uh, ward to your benefit tends to be uh, with it. That makes sense. So, hang out here until about four seconds, just in case someone tries to do something sneaky at the last second. Sometimes I'll ward it if I see them hanging around, but it doesn't look like that's happening. W first because it does the most damage, because it does percentage of health. and then you make sure they can't steal it. Uh, if you want to play super safe, you go to Wolves next. I'm not worried about a Kha'Zix gank. And also, I'm pretty tanky. I think if he did try to gank me, he actually would end up killing himself. Using the first potion. Hmm. I could go bot and gank. I'm gonna get level three instead and then go mid. Uh, I think they're calling for me. I'm considering going bot. They are pushing pretty hard though. I want this level three before I go in. I need the slow from my Q. Going bot. Oh, they are super aggressive. I could definitely change the situation. However, if Kha'Zix shows up, we're in trouble. Nope. Okay. So me showing up allowed the allowed them to scare off the uh, support from continuing to be aggressive, and that's what gave them the kill. So mission accomplished, even though I didn't get any sort of indication of that, and I certainly didn't get any gold from it. It actually was a very successful uh, gank. And yes, that qualifies as a gank, even though I didn't land a single spell. Simply my presence there changed the outcome of that battle for the good. And that's, that's the purpose of jungling, is to turn those situations that would typically be losses into at least not a loss and ideally a kill for someone. Because I'm not going to scale with the... Uh, 
I just need to hit a certain level of tankiness. I'm not scaling with... I'm not building damage. My sole purpose is to get in the way of shit the enemy is trying to do. Uh, okay. Mm, okay, there's the mid. So I'm looking for a gank again. I'm curious why... Seems unlikely to happen. I'm gonna go for it anyways. Okay, I got a flash. That's a successful gank. <clears throat> Bot lane is dominating. That's good. We're getting kills on our ADC. Um, I just saw the enemy jungler top. That was a mistake. Incredibly greedy. Incredibly greedy on my part. I regret it. <laughs> I regret it. But I'm coming back in. The main reason why I'm coming back in is because I know I can... I know I can get this. So, um, I knew the Alawi could tank that. The question is, does she want me to help her push, or... No, I'm gonna leave it. Uh, so I'm getting Skirmisher's Saber, mainly because I'm facing a Kazakh jungler, and it's going to save me in a one-on-one -on -one by reducing his damage. Um, and I'm prioritizing hit points and boots because something's going on bot. That was a mistake. I don't know why the Janna was so far out. That was a big mistake. It's just our first kill. Hopefully the Janna learned something from that and doesn't do it again. Uh, it's hard to say. Okay. I don't know why the Lucian's still being aggressive without a support there. That seems like a mistake to me. However, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna F with this Kha'Zix. I'm gonna go bot. I don't think I'm gonna get anything. had my ult, it would be worth chasing, but I don't. Take away from the enemy jungler whenever you can. I'm just gonna take them both. That gave me my ult. Um, yeah. If my ADC will come here... My wires are on my hands. So you set up the barrel, load up your W. Oh! Oh!
<laughs> oh man. Oh, that was so good. Uh, that ADC saved my life with the heal. That is fucking team play. Let me tell you. Uh, I can count. Uh, it would take both my hands and feet to count the number of times on my uh, fingers and toes that an ADC withheld their goddamn heal when they could have saved me from certain death. I don't know. <laughs> but this one, he made the sacrifice and gave me the heal. Um, and that's that's just good teamwork. That's just good teamwork. If you can save someone else with the summoners, uh, do it. Ooh. I almost accidentally stole that. This is about. What is this about? Is this a gank? What is this? Oh, almost. All right. Nope. Go bot. Go bot. Go bot. Might be able to save someone. I'm just keeping them here to, to keep them here. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Don't know what happened top. I'm taking that CS because I'm a jerk. But it was about to die. They would have died before they got there, so I may as well have taken it. Uh, finished our jungle item. Gonna buy a pink ward. Uh, I've probably lost the majority of my top jungle, if this Kha'Zix isn't crap. If he is crap, it'll all still be there, and that'll give me a good indication of the level of quality of the jungler that I am facing. Uh, the reason that it should all be gone is because... If you see, <laughs> wow, he's bad. If you see the enemy jungler in a lane, and you know they're nowhere near their red or blue, you can go take it. There's no reason not to. Wow, they're really focusing on that bot lane. This is, yeah, you're not going to be able to help him. You need to shove your lane. Just shove, 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 shove. Let's do this. The reason that we're doing this is for first blood. Tower first blood. So we're creating map pressure by just by being here and forcing this. And since Kha'Zix is there, guess what? Oh shit, you got shut down gold. Don't like that. Don't like that. Uh, however, I get a free blue. Potentially. Potentially I get a free blue. I thought there was potential for a gank. Um, looks like the answer is no. I should be able to get into this brush without being seen. No, I can get into this one. In theory, I just got into that one. Oh, we are fucked.
Yeah, that was actually poorly played by me. I could have done that a lot better. Um, hmm. He can definitely chase them down. Okay, that was well done. Uh, and yeah, that Kha'Zix fucking sucks, dude. I don't know what he was thinking. She has no magic resist. So we're gonna get this tower. Shit. I'm fucked. I fucked that up. I saw her wind that up. I should have been out of there immediately. That was just poor play on my part. Uh, what do I need to prioritize? Um, I want to prioritize for getting stunned, getting out of the stun so I can do things. So I want tenacity. Primarily I need tenacity. I am watching chat. If you wanted to ask me any questions, feel free. Or at least I'm trying to watch chat. If I'm in the middle of doing stuff, obviously I'm not watching chat. Uh, anyways, so I'm going to get that. I have 300 gold. I always pick up armor if I have 300 gold like that. So... There is a Kha'Zix, there's no reason not to get armor. Obviously, a, a Jin could wreck me in the right situation. So, more armor, never a bad thing. Uh, I need to hand over the blue. That's been up way too long. I saw... I just saw the Lissandra going that way, so we need to do something about that. Oh! What the fuck? Shit. Ugh. Okay, we just got all their ults. I'm uh, pretty happy about that. Because that's going to give us the dragon. There's absolutely no way the Kha'Zix can outsmite me. He is far lower level. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, that really hurt. Okay, it didn't kill me. I wasn't afraid of dying. I could have chugged that potion a little earlier, and should have. And I need my mid to come here to collect this. Hurry up. There we go. One of my pet peeves is when the... <laughs> <laughs> the mid will not come and take the freaking thing I'm trying to give him. It's like I'm being super generous here. I could certainly use the mana myself. Um, please, take it and win more. Um, I have to go bot right now. I definitely have to go bot right now. Nope, there's two top. I just saw Kazakh's mid. Oh, nicely done, nicely done, nicely done. Did I get it? Almost. Got it. So that's a good one to... Um, That's a good one to smite because it's going to give me some extra damage on this tower. If I could, oh, hello. <laughs> Where are you going, buddy? Oh, mistake. Oh, he's good. He's good. I love it when my ADC is good. Uh, I'm not paying attention to top lane. They're in trouble. I should have gone up there immediately. Instead, I'm creating pressure here because I feel like I wouldn't be able to get there in time. Uh, is that too late? I think that's too late. It's probably too late. 
Wow, this Kha'Zix is fucking terrible. I don't know if it's just like... Maybe he just doesn't normally jungle? It could be. Ugh, I hate that last minute chase there. So it's entirely possible that this uh, this is an off roll for this Kha'Zix. I didn't fully get in the bush, by the way. That's a you don't want to back when you're outside the bush if you could be inside the bush, and it's like two seconds away. I'm prioritizing cooldown reduction at this point. Um, mainly because I'm more worried about having my ult available to engage or disengage than I am pure stats as far as armor or magic resist. I only died once and it was... Um, how did I die? Man, I don't even remember. That's bad. You have to remember why you died. <laughs> if you don't remember why you died. Oh, fucked it up. Oh! <laughs> See? That's just pure laziness. Gotcha. Ooh, thank you. So, this was a relatively easy game. Uh, we could try to wrap it up here, but there's no reason to. There's a... I just saw the Kha'Zix. No? Where'd he go? A nope, 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 nope. <laughs> okay, we're all backing now. I like how my teammates stuck it out with me. Um, so the Kazakhs is no threat. The Jin has not been doing damage to me. Uh, completing the Spirit Visage, which scales incredibly well with uh, the Gragas passive is going to give me the most benefit at this time, so that's what I'm aiming for. Don't know what Alawi was doing. I haven't seen Alawi in a team fight, actually. Oh, they really want this tower? They want it that bad? going to continue the chase, that's fine, but I'm more thinking the dragon. Holy shit, why are they diving a tower? Haha. <laughs> My CS. So I don't know if you noticed, but um, I queue up that barrel as it starts to get low, and then um, in an ideal world you hit your W at the same time, 
and uh, between the Q, your smite, and the W, there's no way that anyone should be able to steal from a Gragas. Unless they, like, freeze you or stun you or something like that. But uh, otherwise, Gragas is one of the few... Or one of the best junglers in, in terms of, like, it's really hard to steal anything from him. I would say that, you know, they, they say that um, stuff like the Baron and whatnot is like a 50-50 chance if the two junglers are equal level. And that isn't true with Gragas because um, you're the one pulling the trigger on the W, the Q, uh, the W and the Q. But I think you could potentially also do its E at the same time, but sort of lose it on the damage. I need to get the Spirit Massage. That's going to be important. And I'm going to go for the Sheen next. Uh, or should I go Thornmail? No, there's no reason to go Thornmail. I'm thinking too much about this. I should just get uh, Pink Ward. That took way too long. That was not optimal. Also, I, sh I need to trade in this. There we go. So the reason I just uh, the reason I want the um, scanner is that what it's called? What's the official oracle lens? The reason I want the oracle lens is it can spot the Kazakhs, and it'll help us clear out a lot of wards. damage. Uh, I don't think there's any reason to get this kill. Did he really? He totes did. Alright. This game's over. I should just be in mid with them. There's no reason to be. I'm just padding out my score. <laughs> So I don't look so I don't look too lame. Uh, oh, there's three of them up, so <laughs> oh, I fucked up. God, I'm so lame. Mm. I flashed for no reason. Literally no reason. Uh, I think I flashed in reaction to their flash. Sometimes that's my instinct, is like, if they flash, I flash. But uh, there was no reason to do that. This game was an absolute dumpster. Um, absolute dumpster. That Kha'Zix has no business. <laughs> that was a mistake. I don't know what you're thinking, but whatever. So as you can see, that Spirit Passage is really paying off in dividends. basically full health again, despite having been at 10% for most of the fights. Because of the spirit besides bring my passive health increase up so high. Oh hey look, that appears now. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, let's look at damage. It's always good to sort of get a overview of how you did in the game. Um, compared to everyone else, yeah. That's a 
that's about what you'd expect when you go full tank. It's about half the damage of your mid or AD. That means you're contributing, but not um, obviously you're not focusing on damage. Um, that was an excellent game. Uh, so that's one in my series. Uh, one win, one loss. So let's go again. And let's hope we get the same group of people again, because uh, let's look at that. Let's look at who these people were. Leave me, senpai. Where's this guy? Do I know this guy? I might know this guy. Diamond 5. Let's look at his history. He's familiar with Gragas the very least. That's one thing that helps is just familiarity with the other uh, other players things that they're playing so just being familiar with what a Gragas jungle does can help you in a game where you have a Gragas jungle on your team if even if you're not the Gragas jungle itself. So that probably contributed a little bit Looks like he plays a lot of positions. Top. ADC and mid. And jungle. A good reason, uh, a good thing to do is to just check who you've recently played. And uh, if you see them again, you'll have an idea of what to expect. Like, this guy, he got caught out a little bit. That's okay. He plays pure support. Is that a support? Yeah, that was a support. Support Katarina? No. Clearly mid. <clears throat> I would not be playing mid Katarina anymore though. Mainly because... <laughs> well... Everyone knows how to deal with Katarina at this point. And if they don't, then... Well, maybe they shouldn't be playing ranked. <laughs> I think everyone knows how to deal with mid Katarina, and that's just to have some form of hard CC, quick hard CC, that you can uh, use. This guy plays mid a lot. I wonder if they were grouped or not. This guy was the weak link for sure. It looks like he primarily plays supports though. Or does he? <laughs> Here we go. Got jungle again. That's beneficial. Um. At least for me it is, because I know I can affect a game more from jungle than I can from support. Or at least based on past experience, that's been the case. <sighs> Leave me, senpai. Hey, it's the same ADC. So, I boss Tina. Do I know this person? I might know this person. She might be on my blocked list. Can I check that now? My name is Tina, it's on my block list. Why is Tina such a popular name in Thailand? Oh, I thought Senpai sounded familiar, but I guess it's just a Japanese term for... Teacher? Is that right? Senpai. What's Senpai in? Senpai means... of a higher social standard. Uh, okay. Interesting. Oh, I just looked it up. It's a Japanese term that someone's of a higher standard, usually used in high school apparently, for, uh, for the younger students to refer to the seniors. 
whatever. Uh, okay, well, I'm glad it's not the Tina I know. She's a terrible person. Terrible person. We've got a Vlad, which I like. Kha'Zix got banned, which I don't understand. Um, we can go Gragas. However, I feel like I want to play some Sejuani, so I'm going to go Sejuani. Trust nothing but your strength. And oh shit! Oh boy! So, not sure how I feel about that particular jungler, uh, Kindred. Um, generally speaking, unless they're really good with Kindred, they tend to be terrible. Just really shitty ults. That concerns me greatly. Please don't throw this game because you... <laughs> okay sake. I know he's good at uh, at that. Should I have stuck with Gragas? Now I'm feeling like I should have stuck with Gragas. No, this is fine. Oppressor is super good on Sejuani. <clears throat> because everything Sejuani does slows. And that's super good as well. So really it's the same as Gragas, except um, her... No, it's really the same. It's really the same. Um, yeah, I'm going to stick with Fat Jungle. There's a good mix on the team of AP and AD. So I see no reason to... to switch up my runes. Hey, it's not appearing again. No, it is appearing. Okay, I finally got the order on my sources in OBS to not be stupid. And that's the goal of life, is to not be stupid. Uh, chat is hidden. Why is chat hidden? Oh, I see. Well, well. According to this, I'm offline. How can I be offline? Whatever. Whether or not I'm offline, I don't care. <laughs> um, hmm. All right. Uh, same start as Gragas. Everything's the same as Gragas. Really, there's no difference between Sejuani and Gragas, except for... Um, so here's my thinking in picking Sejuani over Gragas. The Gragas ult is really great for engage or disengage. Why? I think we're way too heavy on AP. Yeah, we are way too heavy on AP. I think that uh, in terms of working with a Vlad, and in this case also an Oriani, Oriana, uh, the Glacial Prison is much more valuable than the Grog Assault. Because the Grog Assault helps you keep keep people safe or, or whatnot. But the uh, Sejuani ult locks people locks a group, big group of people down, and the closer they are together, the more screwed they are, which gives the Vlad and the Oriana time to react with their own ults, and if the enemy team, or if the reaction is quick enough, it's basically a guaranteed two to five man kill, depending upon how I land my glacial uh, prison. So this is definitely a wombo combo team, Every member of the team has something they can add to the Wombo combo, um, except the Lucian. 
though he can land his uh, Q across a good number of people if we lock him down. So, this should be good. This should be a really good team. Especially based on what I saw from the uh, Lucian in the last game. I go Q second for the uh, reduced damage due to the time they are in the air. Like that. So one of the things I don't have on this particular rune set um, is cooldown reduction, which I do have on my... Oh wow, that's a really freaking early gank. Okay, I was worried, but I'm not gonna... Not gonna bother. Uh, one of the things I was concerned about was an early gank from uh, Kindred, which may be incoming. why I saved. I did this camp second and then did this one to uh, avoid the possibility of my blue getting stolen by by Kindred. So so far so good. I really 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 want to go bot. Head over there and see. That's not good. Okay, we got some flashes. That's a successful game. Did we get a flash? We got a flash out of the... Did we get a flash? Wow, I'm really... I'm autopilot right now. I don't know why. I don't know if this is a smart idea either. So I'm going to leave my red up. Because I think the kindred will... Shit. I just lost control of my mouse. What the frick? Frickin' frick. All right. Uh, I'm gonna prioritize skirmishers and head back out. I'm really concerned about the kindred getting free stacks. I don't want anything to be free for this kindred. Vlad is feeding. Okay, he got the kill, but that's really bad. Giving kills to a Riven who can absolutely steamroll a game is super dangerous. I want to make sure that this Kindred does not get... No, oh, shit. I did not have to do that. I did not have to do that. I did not have to do that. I flashed for no reason, and I feel like an idiot. <clears throat> um, but that's one of the big, big, big drawbacks of being Kindred, is where you're going to be is super obvious. And as a result, I get that. And could potentially go into his jungle for more. However, uh, respawns are super fast this early in the game. And I don't want... And there's a there was a distinct possibility of getting collapsed on from both the mid lane and the and the bot lane. And I prefer to wait until I'm a little bit tankier. Also, without my blue buff, my mana is super fast gone. What? Is he having okay, yeah. I should be paying more attention to top because he's definitely having problems up there. I need to, but I don't I don't want to go up there and potentially feed um, 
feed the Riven more kills, <laughs> which is a distinct possibility. <laughs> Holy shit, he's gonna execute himself. Okay. I mean, yeah, good. Uh, so once again, I want to make sure this Kindred is kept down. As jungler, this is going to be my main duty. Not gonna get it. Not gonna get it. Not gonna get it. Really close, but not gonna get it. Uh, that would have been really good if I could have gotten that. Actually, I would have preferred that. Did he get that? Oh, that would really piss me off. I would have preferred that the um, our mid laner get the kill on the ribbon and get the shutdown goal, because that would really cement uh, a steamrolling Oriana is. Scary as fuck. Scary as fuck. Happy to hand the blue over to her. She was more than happy to come mid and help when I was in trouble. And she's come to every everything I've pinged and called for. And that's exactly what you want in a teammate. So I have my ult now, so I'm definitely going bot lane. Alright, no reason for me to go bot lane then. Um, however, we should be able to get this dragon, and we should try to get this dragon. I did just use my smite recently, so I'm a little bit worried about that. I would prioritize this dragon higher than even first blood tower at this point. Wow, my team works together. I'm loving this. This is so rare. I don't know what's going on today. This is it's like it's like they want me to get diamond. <laughs> I just screwed up my smite. <laughs> we'll pretend that didn't happen. So we get that and my potion. That makes me happy. Um I love Corrupting Potion on any jungler with mana. The main reason why is the additional true damage and the burn. Between that burn and the smite burn, um, 90, 90 true damage over 3 seconds plus uh, 19 magic damage over 3 seconds, uh, those two in combination can wreck someone's world in an unexpected way. Are they still here? They must. Oh, we're still here. Okay. I want this. Ah. I need that cannon minion to die. As soon as that's dead, I'm up here. Wow, this Morgana is on the fucking ball. So our next goal is to get uh, first blood on that tower. Tower first blood. good. We're definitely going to get it. And if he hangs him around here... Nope. See is. Mm. Okay. I did what I could. We lost the support. Um, yeah. I did what I could, we lost the support. That's a worthy sacrifice for the first blood on the tower and everything.
and we got their blue. And the only one suffering on our team right now is the Blood. He's definitely not having a great time. I need to prioritize clearing out my bot jungle. Um, mainly because I don't want to give anything free to the enemy jungler. Not that he would ever come into my jungle at this stage. He's really totally hosed. He was caught out. He was just being dumb. Can't expect, can't expect him to keep uh, keep trying. But uh, I'm gonna prioritize armor. I think they've got enough ads that that's my main concern. Yeah, one, two, three, and he's kind of an ad. I know he's magic, but he's he does more damage with his fists than he does with his uh, spells. Ooh. She's okay. Just trying not to give away the uh, support kill. I need help to do this. Give this to the Vlad to cement his uh, taking of. I don't want this. I kind of wanted it to go to the Vlad, but I'll give it to the Oriana. Uh, you max E second on Sejuani. For the additional slip. I always smite Gromp on a tank because that's a huge amount of damage uh, dealt if they attack you. Um, okay, he's in trouble. I'm going top. Uh, drinking a potion now to maximize health. If he stays there, I can get into this bush, no problem. I can let him chase. And now we will get this tower. So I tanked the tower so he could chase her down without having to worry about uh, tower aggro killing him. I know that Vlad can pool, but uh, I think in this case uh, it was better that I tank it for him to leave him the option to pool if she turned and tried to kill him. So happy with how that turned out. Um, am I worried about stuns or slows? Not really. I'm gonna go with Ninja Tabby and more armor. Uh, I will not be getting a Spirit Massage, I might get a Banshee Bale to prevent the initial burst from what's-his-face. No this game's pretty much over. The only way we could lose now is if we just like massively throw or someone just keeps getting caught out. Um, but they haven't been doing anything that, to me, would indicate that they're even capable of coming up with that sort of a plan. So I'm not really worried. Okay. They're not even going to try and stop this.
Vlad is solo killing people now. This is just crazy. That's too much. He's the one person I need to be a little, little bit more careful about. Okay, well, that's one way to do it. game is not going well for them. I would feel pretty bad if I were in my promotion series and I was getting teammates like that kindred. Uh, no, we don't, we don't need this. We don't need this. Definitely don't need this. The fuck? No, 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 no. back now. Get out of here. Get out of here. Fuck you thinking. What's one more kill gonna do? <laughs> it's all risk, no reward. Because they're so far behind. The only thing we could do now is take... The only bad thing we can do is take risks. gonna get the dead man's plate for the additional uh, additional speed actually I think just getting to a location from which I can use my ult is higher priority now than it is like any stats does it boost my speed increase in movement speed by up to 60 to 100. Yeah, that's a significant amount. It's quite significant. Yeah, look at me go. Yeah. Love that effect, too. Alright, this game's over. There's no way they can contest this. I have armor. Nothing that she can do to me. I'm just trying to keep them away. There's nothing they can do. <laughs> Why did I do that? I ruined my perfect game. I had no deaths before that point. There was no reason, no reason whatsoever to dive into that fucking fountain for one kill. That's stupid. So you look at damage, I did nothing. Pretty much nothing. Uh, I was carried that game so, so very clearly by that Lucian 905. Holy shit. I'm the only member of my team who didn't get an S. <laughs> 
Well, what are you going to do? Um, play again. If you're on a win streak, keep going. should invest in some anti-boredom pills because this is not cool. Oh, I've got this turned off, don't I? Did I? No. Oops, so long. So, now chat doesn't show up. See, I don't understand OBS anymore. Stray bar. Still true, even with a webcam. Doesn't really help. <sighs> Monitor capture. Oh, yeah, yeah. Then you have the infinite void. I hate that. It's the streamer's dilemma. I've got the um, I've got the chat pop out, but if I show it, it doesn't it doesn't appear. So I was using monitor capture, but then I have OBS on that second monitor, so then it gets weird. Let's see who's yelling at me on Facebook. Oh, gosh, that's fast. So I got jungle again, which is really unusual. <clears throat> Let's see, who's on my team? I'm looking for the people who sucked. <laughs> like this guy. Alright, these are completely different people. I'm hoping that Leave Me Senpai and and er, yeah, and Boss Tina are not on the other team. Who's the mid before who was good on my team? Oh, this guy's terrible. Never ever want to see that guy again. Uh was it Lavi? No. Henry. Is he on here? There he is. It's the same lad. He did okay. Yeah, he did okay. He he did die first. He did give first blood. That wasn't great. It's mm. Soraka ban, I guess is standard. Graves, Malzahar, Soraka. Who bans Graves? I guess he is a really strong jungler. I find him incredibly annoying, but I tend to play tank jungles. And I have played Graves jungle before, but I'm not good enough with him uh, that I would take him into a promotion series. I need more practice with him in normals. Ha! Ah, we just had Vlad taken away. Um as their first pick, which is uh, not good. Not good at all. Not good at all. Makes me want to take Fizz.
Uh, I think I might have to carry this game based on what I just saw. So, this is a very different playstyle from my tank stuff. In this one, we're prioritizing uh, hybrid penetration to maximize the possibility of a kill, an early kill. And we're taking, I call it Teemo, but it's really um, glass cannon, <laughs> is really what this is. Uh, so sometimes I go Assassin, sometimes I go Runic Affinity. Merciless, yeah. So our goal here in this case is to get an early kill. And I'm gonna go Void Fizz. Because uh, he's darker in color. So it'll blend in a little better than some of my other skins. Like, this one stands out way too much. The last thing you want is, like, white on the backgrounds of the, the tile set. So he's harder to see. I like this one um, for his alt, because his alt is harder to spot coming. Uh, I think it's the little lobster. <clears throat> But he's bright yellow, and that's not good either. So I'll go with the Void Fizz. Mm -mm. Oh, and a game point too? What? And they got Echo? What happened? What happened? Oh, this game's going to shit already. Based on the picks, I would say we're definitely going to lose. At least so far. Um, we don't have nearly enough CC to justify this. And the way that most of our guys deal damage, with the exception of our ADC, gives the gangplank a huge advantage. So based on champ select, I would say we're gonna I'm definitely gonna lose this match and won't be one step closer to losing my series. So let's hope that's not the case. It depends on who those people are. I guess we'll see in a second. Oh shit. Their Sivir is the ADC who destroyed everyone in the last game. And he's definitely grouped with that support. However, their gangplank is uh, this guy, Pussy Wet or Die. He's fucking terrible. But he's also grouped with this guy. Uh, these two are grouped. So we just have to hope that our ADC support combo who's playing extremely off-meta weird stuff can somehow defeat this ADC support combo who are also grouped and I've personally seen destroy the enemy lane. This is quite scary. I don't know I don't know their jungler Habu. Never seen him before. But Echo Jungle I'm not No, not scared. Not scared of an Echo Jungle. If he turns out to be really good it might change my mind. <laughs> oh yeah, I've got a camera on me. Can't be picking my nose. Gross, Dave. Why are you so gross? I don't know, just gross. How do we win? Basically, the Tristana has to win this game for us, because Vladimir is going to flash and ghost. Really? Uh, Vladimir should probably destroy this Lissandra. I don't... I don't see Lissandra doing very well in this matchup. 
You know, now that I see the void skin, this purple, not so great. Not so great. For some reason I thought the tile set was darker than it is. But he kind of pops a little bit. Uh, yeah, he's not going to blend in very well. I'll have to look at the other skins. about an invade. I do think that I need to make an aggressive move towards bot early because in theory that Sivir is going to run down that um, Tristana. aggressive moves that I saw from the enemy. running away until we get our skills back. You have to, with Fizz Jungle, you have to do that. Um, and you have to let that get run down a bit. You're trying to avoid as much damage as possible so that you can get through your initial jungle uh, and not have to back for the third camp. I have killed myself on those wolves, <laughs> which is embarrassing, but true. Normally I'd prioritize a corrupting potion. Jesus Christ, bot lane. Okay. He's not farming very well. Let's make a comparison. Let's move these. I need to know how this matchup's going at all times. They didn't miss a single CS. I'm hoping for an early gank here. I don't think I'm going to get it. Dumb. That was dumb. Yeah. There was absolutely no reason for me to do that. The moment I hit that cue, I knew it was a bad idea. That was a very unsuccessful gank. In oh, shit. fine. He got nothing. So I don't care. I'm gonna go 
top and try for a gank. Not optimistic. I should be bot lane, but I feel like I can't. his stupid shit. Oh, that's painful. We need boots. Bot lane, how are you doing? Holy shit, no! Shit's bad. Shit's bad. I think we're losing every lane. Yeah, we are. He's mine too. Goodbye. So that was fortunate. Um, so what I saw in my previous game with the previous two games with him is that he was super aggressive all the time. That can be used to my advantage. That's what I should have been thinking about. And I should have prioritized bot lane earlier. And I should have started red, for being honest. And that's my bad. Oh. I'm gonna go mid. That's really disappointing. That's really, really, really disappointing. So I was thinking I should get my runic echoes, but now I'm thinking I need an abyssal scepter. Nope, can't do it. Ah, uh, damn it. What is this? Okay. Bot lane. In trouble again. I need to be there. Holy shit. get him? She didn't have a red buff. She, she did not have a red buff. Okay, I think we should get this. Nope. Not gonna do it? Nope. Nope. No one's gonna do it. Alright. <sighs> Alright. So, I think we could have taken the dragon at that point. And we should have. Um, it's a little concerning that they wouldn't go for it. 
when we had such high advantage. Okay, he wants that. That's fine. You take it. Did I finish? I did finish. All right. So I finished my. He wants more help. <clears throat> I finished my runic echoes. Okay, look, I know getting you ahead is important, but... Man, you gotta be able to hold your own a little bit. Oh. He's right, though. This is free kills. I need to be here. There's no reason not to be. No good. <clears throat> I don't think I'm going to be able to outplay this guy. Even as Sivir. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is dumb. What are you doing? No, now we're all fucked. Too aggressive. He's better than you. <laughs> He's just better than you. That's just true. We are just losing everything. We already lost tower first blood at, up in top lane. And now Jan is going to feed. Jesus Christ, you know, what the fuck are you doing? He's unkillable.
So, I have to get a Merlin on the con in order to kill this Vlad. Absolute highest priority now. There's no other option. Without a Merlin Omicron, he will never die. And uh, GP will never die. And, and this game, there's not really much of a chance of this one in this game. Let's be real. if you not take those to the face. There is no realm in which we win. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, I've just been paired up with the worst players of in every lane <laughs> which is impressive because this guy Puzzy wet or die is fucking terrible <laughs> so bad uh, just has no sense of lane priority or anything really let's see if we can kill GP I am unseen What are you doing? Oh my god! Fucking hell. <clears throat> Ugh, god damn it. He's so bad, I don't know what to do. Alright, at least he got the shutdown. That's gotta be worth something. <laughs> no, you have no mana, you can't do anything. What are you doing? Get the fuck out! <laughs> Fucking lord. Oh, this is so sad. This is so sad. Finish my Morellos, but it's pretty clear it's too late for this game. Um, there's still a chance. There's still a chance. Let's not go super negative. There's still a chance that uh, our ADC uh, can out team. F Eventually, he'll outrange the enemy Sivir. So if this game goes 
long enough, we will be able to win. It's a trap. All right. This trap's not going to work. Could potentially kill the server. The server is alone. This leaves mid. Oh, no. <laughs> no, God, no. No, what are you thinking? <laughs> You're not faker. Holy shit. We're just fucked. We're just fucked. So, at this point, what does it really matter what I build? It doesn't really matter. We're about to lose the game. Definitely doing the Baron. No one's gonna come. Tristana's going bot to farm. Yeah, fucking. That's the difference between our ADC and their ADC. Their ADC works with their team. Our ADC does not. So it doesn't matter what I do because. This Tristana is just going to go out there and solo die. <laughs> is there a chance that I get this kill? Let's fight it highly unlikely. Nope, definitely not. Definitely not. We have no vision of where they are. Our one chance is to set up a crazy gank. So that was good. I am still an assassin. We now have the potential to have a 4v5. Shit, that gangplank. Oh. Definitely need Zonia's. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I give up. We're not gonna win. Um, no matter how late this game goes. Not with that Vlad. Yeah, another dragon for free. Another tower for free, another dragon for free. It's just not gonna happen for us. Uh, I'm trying to get to my zonias. I'm prioritizing cooldown reduction. I also need to buy another defensive item after this. No, where's my team? Where's my team? What were you 
doing? <laughs> I don't understand. But yeah, this is the difference. Their team, boom, instantly collapse. Instant collapse. Our team, farm, farm. Huh? Oh, is there a team fight? Oh. No. I had him, if you would come. We can't see anything. No forward wards. No, I think for we lose this game already. Yes, that was my bad. to look for an advantage we can take here. This guy is not as is not tanky at all. He's looking for an opportunity to uh, Okay, we're doing fucking Baron. Can't even we can't even contest it. Nothing I can do about this. Yeah, there's literally nothing I can do about this. Is this clear? Oh. something. <laughs> Unfortunately. Fuck. Come on. 
Just end the game, assholes. Jesus. <clears throat> well, that ties me up. Two wins, two losses. That means the deciding game will be the next one. Uh, if I get Leave Me Senpai on my team, I will win. If not, I will lose. So... As you can see, I did the majority of the damage for the team. I was trying to carry. If I had built tank, if I had been a tanky champion, we would not have had the damage output to even hold what we had. Every lane lost, top lost, mid lost, bot lost. So, again, I, I saw it on champion select, we were going to lose that game, but what are you going to do? All right, I'm out of here. I want to be on the team that gets Leave Me Senpai. Not on the team that gets Fuzzy or Wet or the other guys. I should have reported that guy for his name again. This guy. <clears throat> Apparently he should just play Gangplank, because he wins every game he plays Gangplank. And he loses every other game. Why did he play... <laughs> Ugh. I think those matches are from yesterday, where I played with him. Let's see who's on my team. Mm. Bad start already. And I'm support. And I can't leave, because that's an automatic loss, and I would lose my series. So. I don't see any of these guys from my previous games. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see them in any of my previous games. did not get an answer <laughs> as to whether or not our... It's gotta be first pick too. Oh, Jesus Christ. No... Blood. We're fucked. Uh, they can take Vlad here, and they probably will. If I were them, I would. Assuming any of them play it. Tom Kench, what the fuck? <gasps> Tournament. Tournament full. Damn it. Oh. Shit. 
shit. Um. Fuck. So we're gonna go with Gragas. So I'm thinking Gragas into Tom Kench. <clears throat> oh shit, that's not a support Tom Kench. That's not a support Tom Kench. Um, well, that's not great. Oh, and it's a vein. So let me see here. Tom Kench is an AP, right? Does Tom Kench do AP or AD damage? Tom Kench. I think he does AP, but I'm not sure how he's played. He does health bonus magic damage. Maximum health bonus damage. Magic damage. Okay. Okay. I would. I'm thinking. Yeah. I'm going full armor. The goal is to just be a brick fucking wall that they cannot get through. <clears throat> so in this matchup, Jin versus Vayne. I have no idea how it goes, but Jin outranges Vayne and has crazy auto crit fourth shots that should, in theory, make this a favorable matchup for us. And I'm not familiar with this guy. I don't know any of these players on either team, so. It'll be interesting, I'll say that much. We have a Lee Sin jungler. If he's good, that means early, early and mid game ganks. He'll fall off late game, but Jin will pick up late game, and Trundle will be, after level 6, will be consistently good. My big concern is how this top lane matchup between Tom Kench and Trundle goes. I don't actually know. I think Tom Kench wins it until level 6. Um, and then Trundle should be able to beat the shit out of him. In bot lane, uh, I think that Gragas is a favorable matchup against Braum. Uh, because his barrel goes through that shield. Oh shit. Actually, I don't know that for sure. Maybe I'm lying. That might not be true. <laughs> that might not be true. Uh, Relic Shield is what you get on Gragas support to make him a little fatter. So we've got 50 armor at level 1, um, which is a lot. And typically I'll max my W first, but I'll get it third as opposed to second. And right now I'm just waiting to see if I need to get my E. Oh, 
Oh man. <laughs> no one's coming. Where's my team? Where's my team? Where's my team? What are you guys doing? <laughs> oh my god. I hate you guys. Fine, fuck it. So that's a bad sign. It shows that my teammates are not the uh, kind of people who are going to help you if you get in trouble, and then they're going to accuse you of being bad and say play safe, play safe, and other stupid shit. So, not looking forward to this. And my ADC seems to be kind of lazy or something. I am worried about one thing. Brahms Q and the subsequent things it does are uh, magic damage. Ugh. The range on Brahms shit really is annoying. Oh, what? No! Ah, I can't believe I missed that. I feel like an idiot. Did they put a ward in here or not? Oh, it does not go through the shield. I was absolutely mistaken. I was mistaken. Away, dude. Oh, if that had hit. This is a good point to back. Uh, I'm just gonna upgrade my Targons. Even though what I, I probably should have gotten the Corrupting Potion, but I'll leave that, leave that be. If we had a good jungler, he would have ganked bot. Um, he's not ganked anywhere, as far as I can tell. And he's Lee Sin, which means that we have a bad jungler. <laughs> if you're Lee Sin and you haven't ganked and probably gotten a kill by level uh, by level two or three, yeah, you're not you're not playing Lee Sin correctly because all he has is his early game.
I don't know if he wants to. I think he wants to push. Seems like he wants to push. Is he? go get the um, Skarner thing. And, uh, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Oh no, oh no. Oh my god. Oh. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I suck. <laughs> That's not going to say about that. Uh, I need boots. So I would say that the Jin's going to win this. The Jin's definitely far more powerful than the, the Bane is. Say what you like about Gragas' support. I think it's really, really strong. Really, really strong. No, no, no! Fuck!
Oh, I have not seen that before. Hmm. Need more HP. Also, want to get this. Sh Actually, wait. What do I want to do with this? I think I want to get this. Yeah, I want to get that. Um. <clears throat> I'll just get more hit points now. This is so bizarre. This game. I think eventually we win this. Right, no, it's really contingent on how good this Yasuo is. If the Yasuo is really good, and it doesn't seem good. I don't know. Hard to say. It's hard to say. It's really hard to say. Try to save you. Uh, fuck. An enemy has been slain. <sighs> Whatever. Uh, what do we need? Yeah. Cooldown reduction. I need more belly flops, more Qs, more Ws. Can get the tower. Oh, we're gonna lose the tower. Why? Why would you do that? Again? Oh Jesus, no! <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Alright. Need Merc Treads for stun. No, what are you doing here? Why would you even... What is you thinking? Why? Alright, that's fine. Shut down gold. 
Shut down gold, always good. I don't understand what's going on. So I got the Merc Treads for uh, the three stuns, the three hard CCs they have on their team. Four hard CCs. God. <laughs> okay, okay. Take this tower all by yourself, buddy. You take this tower all by yourself. How did I not see this before? How long has this been here? That's really worrisome that I didn't notice that. Okay. My survivability is critical. <laughs> So I'm just going to jump to that to get more health, and then I'm going, I need to build the Frozen Heart. Oh, fuck. Is this more important? This is more important. I need that more than I need uh, more wards. So a little more cooldown reduction, uh, a good chunk of armor, and we're headed towards the, the Frozen Heart, which is going to be super, super critical late game. Um, and in fact, after the Frozen Heart, I'm going to prioritize the other... Uh, heavy armor item that slows people who attack them because I'm getting targeted so fucking hard and it's paying off that I'm building as tanky as possible I misplayed a little bit, I think. I honestly don't know what happened with the... I, I honestly just got lost in that fight. And that's not good. Like, that's a sign of an amateur. Can we get this tower is the question. I think if Jin were here, we could get this tower. Please, more armor. Give me that armor. Oh, man.
So, what can I do? What can I do here? And the key is to keep things warded. Make sure they don't get an opportunity to do anything. Poor shit. <laughs> Why is this happening? The fact that his Q's. his ranged Q does that much damage, just fucking insane. Yeah, Sue is a fucking broken champ that really needs to be picked or banned every game. Ugh. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. I did not need to use exhaust. That was stupid. He was he was caught out. I did not need to use exhaust. Yeah, that's just bad. It's just bad play. That was really well played on our part. <clears throat> That's all I can say. <laughs> uh, next highest priority is Warden's Mail. Wait. 700? Do I wait? No, you don't wait. You don't wait. Not when you have this. So, in, in order of priority, I would say that the uh, this dragon here 
is the highest priority thing in the game. Especially if you have like Jin and like burst champs on your game in your game. Maybe first, if you're going to do that. Oh, what? <laughs> no, not my hero. game's over. So, I think that means I'm diamond? Let's see. Yep. I am now diamond five. Congratulations! Hooray! I can't say that was my best showing. Uh, no, I did okay, I did okay. Let's look at damage quick. 12k. Ooh, well, compared to the other team, yeah. But I don't know. I made it to diamond. I always felt that I was at the level of diamond, or in last season I should have made it to diamond. It just happened that I got screwed by scheduling conflicts and got. Uh, auto demoted while I was not playing um, but yeah I made it and mm, I intend to get to diamond one at the very least I think that that's within the realm of possibility but I need to fix a lot of my poor decision making uh, in heat of the moment situations particularly if I'm playing assassins it's, when I'm playing tanks, I tend to do make a lot smarter decisions and know better when I can dive and when I can't. Um, for whatever reason, if I'm playing an assassin, I'm like, oh god, if I don't get a kill, then I lose the game. Um, which maybe that's the case sometimes, but not always. So I need to work on that decision making. So I'm going to take a break. No one's watching anyways. <laughs> uh, and we'll continue the road to Diamond 1 later. All right. Peace.